Hello and welcome to the virtual groom room. My name is Jackie Horace and today I am bringing you another shaving video. And my choice of soap is the second use, on the channel anyway, of Loafer. And this scent today is going to be Calm. Now, Calm, if you, if you remember the kind of like initial introduction I did of the Artisan Loafer, you'd know that one of the kind of, I guess, core tenets of Lofa is mindfulness. And Calm is very much inspired by that specific tenant. Um, Johnny is very much a believer in taking some time out of your day to treat yourself, to just think um, very much in the, in the realm of wet shaving. And Calm was made specifically for that. And I think I remember saying in my last video I, I shaved with Lofa, um, <clears throat> all cells from the initial lineup, 5% of those cells are going to go towards a really important suicide prevention charity. So by all means, take a look at that. Um, yeah, re really cool. Let's actually move this down ever so slightly. Cool. Yeah, a really, really nice um, calls. Uh, great soap for great calls. Um, yeah. So Lofa was inspired by someone special in Johnny's life that pointed him towards mindfulness and that got him to take up traditional wet shaving, you know? Um, after having some difficult time in his life mentally, um, after losing a loved one, wet shaving really gave him something to focus on and then a, a really cool Instagram page was born. That, that doesn't exist anymore, unfortunately, but that's how I met Johnny personally. He uh, he had this um, Instagram, it was called Shave Soap Connoisseur, where he would go into deep dives into soap bases. So this, the, this, this label, this brand being born made perfect sense to me. The scent of uh, Calm is as you would expect. It's quite a heavy lavender, but it's balanced with green notes and eucalyptus. I actually love the smell of eucalyptus and it's, it's underused in my opinion. The scent strength on this is probably about I'd say a five and a half to six out of 10. It's very, very enjoyable. And uh, that's, the, that's the shapes that we're gonna be using today, guys. My brush is going to be my Decoration B6 in the Autumn Glory handle color. And this has been loaded already, as you can see. And my razor of choice today is the Titanium Christopher Bradley prototype. Um, and inside that I have a Gillette Nata. So let's get to uh, kind of wetting the face here, and then uh, we'll actually get to lathering up. So yes, I've used Calm a few times. Calm is, it's difficult to say because I like them all so much. Calm is something that is ideal because of the scent profile before going to bed. It's just super relaxing, and that's the point of it, you know? Just take some time out of your day Spend some time to yourself, really think about what's going on. And that's one of those core tenets, as I said initially, that Lofa really thinks about. Minimalistic, masculinity, and mindful. And uh, they do a fantastic job of that. Every, everything they do in that regard is, uh, is definitely spot on. Okay, let's get to lathering up, shall we? I loaded this for quite a while because this uh, knot's pretty dense, but loafer explodes into life anyway. Let's move this camera over here ever so slightly. There we go. You can see already exploding into life. It's what I really enjoy about this soap base. It's one of those soap bases that's just super easy to use. And by the way, JR. I'm only messing.
I really like the subtle scrub of this knot. It's very subtle, but the scrub is not harsh. I love the sheen of this lather too. It's just, it has like this really satisfying sheen. Yeah, man, look at it. <laughs> it just comes together. I love it. And this is definitely one of those soap bases that is shavable early on. I mean, it's usable now, to be honest. But what would be the fun in that, you know? I, on the other hand, love to lather. So we're gonna build this. There we go. Real nice. Okay, cool. So I think I've got the volume I want. It's already starting to get like this. The way I would describe it is it's kind of loose. It's a loose texture. Where you feel it's wet enough to just fall off of your face. And that's kind of what I want. To be honest. Um, very, very well hydrated. This soap is very easy to dial in. It's one of the... At this point, I would call this one of the elite soaps. Um, as far as performance goes, it's definitely up there. And as far as like how easy it is to dial in, it reminds me a lot of Kairos. Um, as far as kind of like its lathability goes, I think it might be even easier than Kairos, which is kind of funny because I, I remember being very, very impressed when I first tried Kairos. Uh, the ease of lather, but I think this uh, exceeds it there. Yeah, man, it's just so good, like. And I did receive these soaps for free. But, uh, like, if you've watched me long enough, you know, I'm not gonna bullshit you. Like, I, I, I'll tell you what I like, I'll tell you what I dislike. Where do I think this soap can be improved? Well, I think that the metric it can be improved is Kind of overall density, is the density bad? No. Could it be better? Yes, I, I think so. But then this is the first soap base he's released to the public. And it's already competing with what I think is the, the best. So I can't, <laughs> you just cannot complain how good it is. Um, as far as like overall metrics go, I honestly think this has the best post shave I've I've experienced in the soap. It feels like putting a high-end cosmetic face cream on. And that in itself, like a wash-off product, is absolutely mental, to be honest. Like, it, it's it's crazy. And that's something I know Johnny really focused on, was getting that post-shave where it needed to be. And uh, definitely paid dividends in that regard. Scent strength on this, on the face, remains very noticeable. It's not the sort of thing that fades away once lathered, which I enjoy. I am a big fan of Calm. Um, to be honest, like I said, I'm a big fan of all of them, really, but Calm is the first one I used. Um, if you're interested in fragrance matching with this, it matches very well, in my opinion, with Maison Francis Kirchen's um, masculine plurial. Let's get to shaving. I'm looking forward to getting the B plate, the C plate for this. I'd even take the B. B's a bit mild for me now. I mean, is it? Is it autopilot? Absolutely. <laughs> Complete autopilot, but at the same time. I think as far as the calf system goes, the C provides like the perfect balance of both smoothness and efficiency. 
the B is smoother than the C, but the difference in efficiency is somewhat noticeable for me. Why am I not running my faucet? Because I noticed that I, I run the faucet a lot and uh, it's quite loud. Real easy first pass, really nice. Very slick, kind of as you would expect from any high-end soap. This is now available via the Razor Company, by the way. Um, they might have sold out on their first, on their initial kind of stocking, but rest assured that they are stocking more. If you want to get a hold of this and don't want to pay shipping from the UK, which I think is might be getting lowered, but even so, if you don't want to pay any of that shipping, then uh. Razor Company is going to restock it with more soaps this time. Very nice. Super easy. I love the sheen. I really love the sheen. See if we can put some more water into it. Yep. Of course you can. <laughs> I found this soap base's uh, ability to just take on more and more water very impressive, actually. Especially considering when kind of there's a point where I think it looks about to be overhydrated and it's just not. Like it's not even a little bit overhydrated. again. Do a cross grain here. Like I said, that B plate is just super autopilot. Like it's just so easy to use. Is there much of a difference in the sea for me? Not really, but... There is a teeny bit more blade fill with the sea. Just a bit, hardly anything, but... Very good soap. I feel very protected. That's completely against the grain, which for me, I just don't do. It's just I'm so comfortable with how this head geometry is. The carve really is the razor I could do that regularly with and get away with it. <laughs> Not that also don't forget how mild this razor is. Like you just don't feel the blade like at all. Very nice. And I think that is the shave, guys. Yep, great shave. A little bit here, so we'll get that. Cool, okay. As always, let me get all this on the face. It's gonna be a ton of it. Let me get this on the face, clean up the gear, and I will see you guys for the final thoughts. I'm not gonna use a power shave again, because I don't need to with this product, but See you soon.
Hey guys, it's uh, Final Thoughts time, not Polish Shave time. What's that about to say? Ah, it's a great show. The initial post for this is fantastic and it only gets better, I have to say. It's really, really nice. I'm going to get a haircut today as well, get rid of all this rubbish. But what did I use today? I used Loafer's Calm, as you can see there. I hope you can see there. Uh, lavender Eucalyptus, really nice green herbaceous notes. Beautiful scent. Um, incredible soap performance. Great cools. You just can't really go wrong with love. Uh, I have to be honest. Um, it's impressed me so much. Uh, like I said, I tested this for a year. And where it was good, that soap-based version is better for me. Um, I really, really enjoy it. Um, the brush I used today was the Declaration... B6 Autumn Glory. This is one of them that's never going to leave me. Um, it's been with me for quite a while now, and I thoroughly enjoyed the B6. And my razor of choice today was the Carve Christopher Bradley in titanium. That's the prototype. They should be coming fairly soon, as far as I'm aware. But yeah, what a great shave. Uh, I know I'm going to have a good post shave from this product. I don't need a post shave product. But yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed the video today. If you're new around here and haven't yet subscribed, Please consider doing so, I'd very much appreciate it. Apart from that, my name is Jack, your host from the Virtual Grim Room. Wherever you are in the world, have a wonderful day, and goodbye for now.